back into the game. He just preached the word right there. That was pretty good. Great change of pace, McKinley Wright. And the kick out to Schwartz, who nails a three. To post up McKinley right down low. Ball doesn't go there, and it's stolen. Gatling on the run. Up high for Schwartz. I'm bouncing from star to star tonight. What's his name again? I don't know. <laughs> don't you start. Shot clock inside of 10. Great Here's defense. Schwartz hit Great. a three ball. Oh. Left wing earlier. Drew. Good pass. Yeah, that. Again, the Colorado. Healthy. But not a lot of threes. Here's McKinley right in the open floor. Right. Schwartz. Aerial attack with the left. There's no hesitation to Colorado. They're flat, flat out moving the basketball. Schwartz again. Auto starters. Schwartz hits the three. Right. Looking for Bay again. Kicks it back to Parquet. And the bounce pass back there right underneath. <laughs> Schwartz on a runner off the window with the left. Silva stripped out of the double team, and Colorado takes it away. McKinley Wright, four on three. Corner three, Deshaun Schwartz for Colorado. With the same intensity, Stanford is. And Tyler Bay takes it away. But Colorado just 33% from the floor, six turnovers. As McKinley Wright trying to weave his way in. The shot Schwartz from the corner and a three. Schwartz in with the left. Finishes. Well, again, it's wonderful to see winding up his senior year and that he has earned the trust of Mark Fox. I think if he continues to play like this, he'll earn the trust of a lot of coaches. Seward backing in Antisevich, not there. Outlet batted away. Late clock for Colorado. Gatling. Good find inside. Gatling. The strip from Shane Gatling. And Deshaun Schwartz pushing. Off balance, Deshaun Schwartz, and we have a... They've had a lot of success here in the Galen Center. Guy, they're 9-1 and one here in this building, and the one game they lost was a non-conference game against Temple that you and I were here for. But they're, they're definitely on the verge of, of getting their second loss here. Still have a lot of time, but they have no momentum at all as a group. Schwartz right at Rikosner. Right. Here's Tiger Campbell. He's going to try an outside jumper and the rebound off to Batty. He'll hand it to Gatling. Now, Campbell, he has to take those shots so people will play him out there, but in Pac 12 play, he shoots 20% from beyond the arc. Lob inside of the big fella. Score. For UCLA, and they lead the Pac 12 in that particular category. Tad Boyle, very frustrated with that. He knew that one of the keys to the game would be keeping them off the board. Schwartz, nice drive against Smith. Explosive presence. <laughs> Explosive. Doesn't deviate from what he does. Passed up a shot. Now Schwartz takes it. And makes it. Kia player. He's their second leading scorer. He's got to play with making sure his baskets aren't cosmetic. They've got to be meaningful. Good ball movement by the Buffalo. And Tyler Bay, the recipient. Go. Here I say he's scoring at Wills. That was too easy. That's coast what we do, low hanging fruit. Let's <laughs> grab it. Coast to coast, two times, plus a transition three. Wills is that unexpected source of offense you were referring to. Doing a great job for the Cardinal right here. Deshaun Schwartz, the leaner. He did go for 25 a few weeks ago against Arizona. It's an uphill battle for Colorado. They've got to get the ball out of the lane, start to contain people, and start to have a presence in the post. This has been a proud performance by both teams. I like what I see with US, USC. They could have folded the tent, but they're here trying to get themselves a stop in the lead. Right with the floater after the backdoor cut. Three on two. Duarte for three. Short. Rebounded by Tyler Bay. Push the ball, Colorado. 
Two on one, get something. Schwartz blocking foul. Whoa. Out of the basket. Play it. Rattled out, but Seward with the back tap. Nice move in, boy. Good. His first three. He's, that's his game. He is. He's a new wave metrics guy. Three point shooter all the way. Schwartz answers. And that's the third foul on Delaire. So Jared Hass going to take him out at the next whistle. Bay hits the three. Block, so get it by his waist, pass it by his waist. The hands aren't there to deflect. I'll tell you, Eddie, that would be a great sign for Cal. They are last in the league in assists. Austin has not been a big assist guy as a point guard. If he makes more plays like that. Tyler Bay. Back tap by McKinley Wright. And Schwartz. That's what Colorado is. Gatling lets fly, so Schwartz dropped it in, and it looked pretty too. As soon as he let it go, I knew that was going on. Well, Cal's averaging less than 60 a game. They have 20 in the first 11 minutes. Nice reverse. Tyler Bay. On a day when they have been significantly shorthanded. And now, all of point Colorado run. Nice get back. Gatling to Schwartz. And Schwartz. Austin to Kelly. And somehow that missed. Right back for Colorado. Schwartz, Gatley, and that one goes down. The right coming downhill, McKinley White will win that battle every time. So three personals on Kelly, 14 fouls each way. We've not had a lot of fouls in the second half. Cal back in that matchup zone. Right. Peyton Pritchard this year. Well, six-pack has really come along here. And so this is a guy who had a lot of injury problems early on in the season. But he looks great right now, thank you to Evan Van Beesler and Clay Jamison. So who's six-pack so that most people can know who you're talking about? Shakur. And why do you or The Cougars off early. Remember last Thursday, Washington State played at McHale against Arizona and led by six early in the second half. And they just had a horrid stretch. I know because I shot one short in the state championship against Crenshaw. <laughs> it was short by about an inch. First trip to the foul line, by the way, for Timmy Allen today. And he made one there to make this a five-point game. Parquet in the corner. Parquet is getting most of the time at that spot today. Schwartz scores. Most people can know who you're talking about. Shakur. And why do you call him six-pack? Is there? Austin outstanding for Dana Holman. And Pritchard Wild out of control play. there. He comes up limping a little bit. Let it fly, Lucas. Seawards three is good. A lot with uh, Mark, ja <laughs> Mark Jackson <laughs> joining us on the crossover with Hall of Famer Bill Walton. I'm Dave Pash. Colorado on a 15-0 run here to take a nine-point lead on the road. First place in the Pac-12 oh. at stake. Colorado leading the conference by a game over the Ducks. And Colorado has been spectacular here after a ragged first couple of minutes. And they're... Hard to fathom. No, he's struggled. And he's five for seven tonight. Well, and he's had some personal struggles within the family in terms of some you know some deaths in the family some things so he's he has struggled but he's come out now and he's playing and oh. speaking of playing Ted, well, when they're in the 890 yeah no and, and for utah it doesn't change a whole lot but you don't want to be the 89 same reason in the ncaa tournament you don't want to play the one eli parquet in the game well gatling at the ref <laughs> yes <laughs> Another empty possession well, for Oregon. 6-2 Ducks. Were you this way as a Only player, though? Yes. <laughs> Three from the corner is good. That was really close to being a turnover, but he put it right on the end of the fingertips of Okongwu. There's so many good big players in the league this year. Schwartz, oh, he needed that. He was from, an from SoCal, but he had to sit out his senior year at Villa Park because the CIF governing body said that he had exhausted all of his eligibility as Deshaun Schwartz gets an out. Smith has been the hot man. 
And that one just looped out. No one has really taken charge offensively for Colorado. Made some mistakes, turned the ball over, and given up some scoring opportunities to the Bucks. He's got a five-point affair. Bruins only one for seven in the second half. And now bustable guy. One or two goes in, and he could change the outcome of this one. Seward knocks it free. Ahead to Gatling with Sahonis on his back. Easy bunny for two. Carter on Bay. Bay taking a deep two. That might just be a tad out of his range. Oh, Schwartz is able to get the offensive rebound. Bay with the teardrop. I'm not saying you can also shoot threes as well, but a fantastic passer for a big one. Sahonis deep corner two short. Achilles Wright coming off a 10.10 assist double double. Another three for the buff. Shane Gatling his. Right for three, knocks it down.